High school students across southwestern Indiana took part in a robotics showcase before the competitive season starts in March. The event is organized by Indiana First Robotics and supported by Indiana Toyota and allows students to get real world experience in science, technology, engineering, and math. We have to, we, we choose everything right off the bat. We have to decide, do we want to do this, this, and this with what resources we have and what skills we have on the team, how many people. The popularity of high school robotics teams has been growing throughout Southwest Indiana. While Jasper High School has had a team for nearly a decade, Evansville North is in their second year and Washington High School is new to competitive robotics this year. We designed it in CAD and we ended up building it off of our designs so that we had everything assembled correctly. Okay, so we're a rookie team this year, so we're trying to make a robot that's really good at one very specific part of the game and do it well over and over again. Teams participating on the district level could qualify for the state competition and from there could qualify for the world's competition coming up in Detroit at the end of April. However, for Indiana First Robotics President Renee Becker-Blau, the focus isn't on tournaments or the robots themselves. When we talk about this program, it's a robotics community that prepares young people for life, and it's really not about the robots, it's about the students. Teams are still preparing for the season, which will begin on March 6th in Bloomington, before another competition in Columbus on March 19th. For TriStateHomePage.com, I'm Ryan Wittree.